G'day guys, Shannon from Black Bear. Just gonna give you a few tips on how to glaze a ham this Christmas. Uh, it's quite a simple process. I was gonna give you a step-by-step -step guide to how we do it here. Okay guys, so what I'm gonna do today, with the shank end, I'm just gonna do a nice little pattern. It's just gonna give it a nice appearance once we're done. Then I'll come up to the, this end of the ham, and just with my hand ever so gently, I'll peel the skin back, making sure that I'll leave the fat on. Once that's peeled all the way back, I'll then score the ham in a nice checkerboard pattern. So to make up the glaze, what we're going to need to do is one cup of brown sugar and one bottle of ginger beer. We're going to mix that up and then we're going to glaze our ham. Just place the ham into a tray and then brush over with a glaze. Okay, so we're going to put this in our Weber smoke fire today for about an hour and a half at 350 degrees Fahrenheit. Every 20 minutes we're going to just baste it with our glaze. Okay, so the ham's been in there for about an hour and 28 minutes. I've been glazing it for every 20 minutes. Okay guys, I've just taken the ham out of the smoke fire. Um, how do we know when it's done? We know when it's done when it looks like this. Okay, we don't need to cook our ham, it's already cooked. We're just adding a bit of temperature and some flavour with our beautiful glaze. So guys, when we carve our ham, we start from the point, we slice down to the bone, and then we slice straight underneath. So to serve our ham, just get some of that glaze from the bottom of the pan. After you slice it, just pour a little bit of glaze over the top and it's just mouth-watering. Try it this Christmas. It's better than Lego.